all right everybody welcome to your second typescript tutorial in which i'm gonna show all those mac geeks out there how to install and get running typescript on their computers so i would recommend you to use this atom text editor for your development of typescript but any of these would go so this is vs code webstrom atom sublime text or eclipse so choose anyone you like and then what you have to do next is install the plugin of that particular text editor so for example i will go to atom and for all those people right there who have just installed atom text editor what you want to do is that you want to go to your text editor click on here atom and click on the here install shell commands and it will just show you this commands installed shell commands atom and apm are installed now you're good to go now the next thing you have to do is go to your terminal write apm install atom type script and hit enter now this would install your atom type script to the this directory and it would be available in your atom text editor then now i'm not gonna install this because i'll not be using this mac for the tutorial purposes so i'm just gonna break out of it but you have to make this installation complete and then once you're done installing this typescript what you need to do is this typescript extension what you need to do is you need to install the real typescript so to do that you'll make use of this npm node package manager and if you don't have node which i highly recommend you should have so go to this nodejs.org and it'll show you the most recent build for node and just download it it is just a next next kind of setup so this should be easy to work with and then once you're done with this hop back to this page or this video tutorial whatever you like and then write in your terminal npm install g typescript and this g just makes your package available globally so hit enter and it's, it's just gonna make you wait a little bit and again i'm not installing this on here on this mac because i'll not be using this eventually so what i'll be using is this typescript for visual studio 2015 but once you have done these two installations of um, typescript and its extension which is this atom extension for typescript or whatever text editor you have this atom typescript once you have done with this you're good to go and then what you have to do next is just go to um, your atom text editor and start writing so that's all for this tutorial and in the next tutorial i'll show all of those windows guys right there how to do the same thing on windows operating system so see you soon